Given that we have this equation, find the exact value of x. So the first thing I'm going to do is write each term as a base power of 3. So I have 3 to the power of 2 or raised to the power of negative a half. And that equals 3 cubed to the power of a quarter divided by 3 to the power of x plus 1. And so using my law of indices, I can multiply the powers. So I have 3 to the power of negative 1 and that equals 3 to the power of 3 quarters divided by 3 to the power of x plus 1. Once again, if we use our law of indices, we can subtract the powers when you divide two indices with the same base. So in this case, I have 3 to the power of 3 quarters minus x plus 1, and that equals 3 to the power of negative 1. And so given as we have two indices with the same base on both sides, their powers must be the same. Therefore, 3 over 4 minus x plus 1 equals negative 1. And so 3 over 4 minus x minus 1 equals negative 1. I can cancel negative 1 on both sides because they're the same. And so we can see that x equals 3 over 4. So my final answer for x is 3 over 4.